场，如果愿意支持孙志峰先生，那么我们前面有一个服务台，这个服务台呢就有签名表格，大家可以在这个签名表格上填上自己的名字，表达自己的支持，那么为孙志峰先生进行捐款，支持他为。我们万锦市的第二区进行服务，谢谢大家。那里有很多的表哥，谢谢大家。好，那么说到钱，我们就说到会计。那么在我们多伦多有一位著名的社区侨领，曾经担任我们 c p a c 的这个加拿大中国专业人士协会的会长，同时他也是著名的会计师沈浩先生，让我们掌声欢迎。好，谢谢。To the podium, Yotin. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm very pleased to be invited to attend this special event. I've known Stephen for many years, close to 20 years, I think, and I know their family. Of course, I know his passion, his passion to build a successful career, the passion to build, to have a good family, and a passion to contribute to the society, to the community. He's a family man, he's a good father, a good son, and a good husband. I saw the two handsome twins of yours. They, you know, under his, you know, care, and of course, Heron together, they went to the famous universities in US and in Canada. Very successful, they have a bright future. And also, somebody may know or may not know, but I do know that his wife, Helen, they had a long, long history. This is something I would like to share with you. They used to be classmates in China, in the university, and they became classmates in Canada again when they are doing their graduate study. And what's more, they finally end up become colleagues working for IBM. That's very, very legendary. <laughs> well, of course, Helen, you know, is very supportive to Stephen's passion. She not only support the family when he's busy with his career, with his you know, community work, but also supports the kids. 2020 in March, everybody knows that COVID-19 just happened probably 15 days ago because of the declared emergency kind of, right? You know, March 15. Stephen wanted to help the community by donating some PPE to certain um, senior homes. One of them, I believe, it is called Mark Haven. At that time, if we all remember, the news was talking about Mark Haven was the first badly hit senior home in Ontario. There were seniors who passed away because of the COVID. At, at that time, there was still two more seniors who were, you know, caught up with COVID. And also seven staff members in Mark Haven was also down with COVID. So it was very critical. But Stephen wanted to make the donation, make this special trip. And he brought 
the two twin sons together with him, and Helen was very su uh, supportive. And Stephen took the risk. He took the risk, the personal risk, to help everybody in the community, to help the seniors in the community. So this is the kind of characters that I think is mostly wanted, needed to become a ward councillor. So, I wish you great success. And you, Stephen, are the kind of uh, people that we want for the community, to lead the community, to become a ward councillor. Thank you very much. Thank you, Howard. Thank you. Wow. 我们沈志峰先生家庭的情况